great game on the menu tonight, folks, between the Pittsburgh Panthers and the Syracuse Orange. Number 23 is the player who deserves our attention in this contest tonight. This is a guy who can create, man. He's my all-time ascension. He's a creator. He can create easy baskets with his passing. He can create for himself with his dribble penetration. And he can create big problems for other teams. The Orange will certainly want to take advantage of his presence on the floor. The Orange know this could go either way, Dick. What are the keys to their success tonight? These are the keys for me, Brad. First of all, don't allow any good looks from beyond New York. Challenge every shot. Second of all, reward your big man. Give him the ball down low. Get him into the game. Let him be part of the offense. And lastly, get busy battling for the boards. Winning teams always rebound well. I couldn't agree more with you, partner. Let's get down to the court and join the action. Both teams are looking to get something going here. On the inside. There he is, strips the ball loose. Takes care of the ball until the offense resets. Fed the low block. That spin move's not gonna work against the defense like that. I tell you, they did a great job scouting post play because they were really anticipating the spin. And the ball goes out of bounds. He missed the guy in the post and goes the other way. Shows patience waiting for the reset. The power forward gets the ball. Takes it off him. He keeps the dribble as they reset. Those long arms trying to get him in front three quarters. I'll tell you one thing, that big guy down inside though is so big that really it's tough to deny him the ball. Gets it to fall. They scored seven in a row. Inside. There's the trap. He stole the ball. Great pressure there. Fantastic ball pressure. The pressure got to the ball handler, and he lost it. Nice little jam right there, the one hand jam and stuff. Little showtime, little pizzazz. Get out the mustard. They work the perimeter. Oh, what a strip, Red. He'll regroup the offense. Got some room. Good job defensively. They just won't give many openings. Pressure in the basketball. Good defensive stance there against the spin move. Well, the key is to beat him to the... Great block shot. And the ball goes out of play. Things are going well. It's going well for the school mascot, too. I tell you, I love those mascots. They put so much enthusiasm and energy in the win. The shooting guard with the ball. Ten seconds on the clock. The ball goes out of play. Up and in and out. They certainly know how to apply the pressure as the shot clock's winding down. Yeah, and you do that by denying open looks anywhere on the court. Stolen away. Hammers it down. The center gets the pass. There's a double team waiting there. They had a shot block. Coach looks on. Focused. A lot of intensity. A lot of emotion. Goes up for two. Knocks it down. Inside. Two. I wonder if he's ever going to get any help from his teammates, Dick. He's doing it all in them some. Right now, it's a one-man show. The other players need to step up. Adam 
Momentary look from three-point land. From right of the circle, he drains it. Smith is emotionally pumped up. I love seeing players play with emotion and passion. There's absolutely nothing wrong with that. Gave it up. A little frustration right there. This young man means so much to this team, and the fans just love it. Yeah, they really know how to show their appreciation for him. On the elbow, they feed down to the low block. Cross court. Tries for two. Great play to take that to the basket. How can you not love this game and the hoopla and fanfare that goes along with it? It's electrifying in here. Nice to have you along with us tonight. Dick Vitale and Aaron Andrews alongside. I'm Brad Nessler. we got a good one going. Takes the pass in the paint. Dick, not a bad drop step, but it doesn't work for him. I tell you, just doesn't beat him to the basket. Not quick enough. And a great reaction by the defensive post player. Now he faces up on the low block. I think it's great when you got a post player that can face up on a defensive player and attack the basket. Trying to pack it inside. Takes away the pass. Dick, a great battle down in the low post, but I think the offense is gaining ground here. Yeah, he's getting great inside position, has the great angle. He's got him set up perfectly for a basket. They got the 45 degree angle, which is essential in entering the ball to the post. Perfectly executed. That's seven unanswered. Turns it over. The shooting guard takes the pass. Looking to move it around the perimeter. He shoots. He missed the jumper off the nice screen. Up and inside. He unloads a three. He gets the bucket. Gives it up, leans in. Gotta make that baby have that wide open angle, have a chance to lay it on the glass for an easy deuce. Dickie's doing a nice job defensively fronting him. Well, it's the key is to really beat him to the spot, get help from the help side, and really do a great job seeing ball and man. Erickson goes to the line for the first time. Good. Second shot, no good. He takes the board. Working it around the perimeter. The power forward takes the feed. Got to think right now. Got to focus defensively. Here's the big man with a drop step. Oh, he does a phenomenal job getting close position, good oh, angle, and then the drop step. Fans are going wild. Oh, I couldn't agree with you more, Mr. Nestler. We are so lucky that we get to go to all these schools and experience the mayhem firsthand. That was really a nonchalant pass. Get that sucker out of the game, man. <laughs> Had him in the low block, but opted against it. The ball goes out of bounds. That 
That's why I love this game, Dick, for that reason alone. Man, it's rocking and rolling in here, baby. Check that out. He's pumping up the crowd. He wants him to turn it up a notch. He's feeling good, Brad. He's feeling really good. He'll visit the charity strike. He makes the first. Goes can. Let's go back on that campus. It's BMOC. Big man on campus, baby. Ouch. That's what I call a hard screen. He bombs from outside. Got it. Looks like the defender's a little bit tired out there. This is no time to be tired. Get a sub if you need a break. Guarding him tightly, and then he went for the steal. An unsuccessful attempt resulting in a personal foul. That's why some coaches don't like it when players go for the steal. They end up with fouls or in foul trouble. Let's go to the third member of our broadcast team. Here's Aaron Andrews. Guys, he seemed very focused from the beginning. His game face was on, and he understands it's his time to perform. Let's send it back to you. All right, thanks, Aaron. And one too many dribbles and a steal. Applying lots of pressure, Brad, and looking for the steal as well. Gave it up. And now there's a whistle and a foul. Oh, and you can see the frustration as he picks up the foul. Oh, that's a bad, bad foul right there, Brad. The Panthers will step to the line for the first time. It's that one. Got them both. He converts on that free throw line, and that's major. For the bucket. Doesn't go. On the outside. Great anticipation defensively. On the dribble, gives it up. Goes up for two. Great play to take that to the basket. Jumper. Nothing but nylon. Nice smooth turnaround jumper. The only negative, he's falling away. If he misses, he's got no rebound in the building. The Big East has always been a competitive conference, but these days teams from this conference are really powerful, too. I don't know what it is, Brad. The teams in this conference are legit. Jumps in. Easy one. That's one of the best parts of college basketball, the student section. They're fired up and they're ready to try to help their team. The student body looks like they're ready to terrorize the opposition. Fast break opportunity here. Tries for two. He nails the bucket. Work the perimeter. Spacing so important. Get 15 to 17 feet apart. They'd like to get it inside to the low block. Unable to so far. Nice job of packing it in defensively. Yeah, they're really doing a great job packing it in. Did a great job of anticipating that lateral pass. Both teams looking to get things going here. 
Gave it up. He tries the three. Syracuse are on a nice little run at the moment, partner. You have to remember, solid defense leads to good offense, which is what we're seeing right now. On the outside, had an open guy in the post and went the other way. And he scores despite the hack. They come with a double team to stop it. Gets it back out. Nicky's working on that low block on that right hip. I'll tell you one thing, he's trying to deny him the ball initially, but the defense really doesn't do a great job of sealing them off. shot that was a great great effort right there trying to play that passing lane anticipating really well looking for a good shot there's the pick there's the roll Controlling the ball. What a great steal. Defensive player was really right on top of that basketball. The fans love it. Just with joy. Hey, that's my guy. He's yelling. They work it back to the outside. Looking to move it around the perimeter. Ball was knocked loose, but the offense got it back. He's got the man in the high post if he can get it there. They strip him in a basketball. Got a little too fancy. Too much mustard there, baby. Gets up to make the block. On the dribble, gives it up. Momentary look from three-point land. And the ball goes out of bounds. That spin move's not going to work against a defense like that. I'll tell you, they did a great job scouting post-play because they were really anticipating the spin. Throws it up from downtown. Syracuse are putting together a pretty good run here. Execution's been the key, baby. Ball comes back out from the post. I tell you, Brad, you got to have a post player that anticipates and knows how to find the open man. Defensively down on the low block, and there's a steal. A oh, terrific job anticipating, reading the offense, and making that steal. Good defensive stance there against the spin move. Well, the key is to beat him to the spot, and he did a great job. He anticipated that spin move. Great pressure, great double team. Really explosive. Yeah, he missed the post guy. The post guy had the great angle, was locking on the box. Stolen ball. They run it up into transition. Whistle, count it, and the foul. That's how he likes it, baby. Oh, oh, young man, be careful. Taunting is definitely a no-no. That'll definitely rub the opponents the wrong way.
He goes to the line for the first time. He can't buy one. And Dick, they just can't seem to find the touch from the line tonight. Well, no time for lessons, Brad. They got to start knocking them down before it's too late, baby. Here's the toss back out from the post. I tell you, coach's dream when your post player can be an exceptional passer. That is a dagger in the heart, that shot, Dick. Hey, they lost focus here. They need a timeout to regroup, Brad. Another turnover. I'm mean, not talking apple turnovers either. This team right now just lighting it up from everywhere. Hey, they're fighting each other in rhythm with their passing, Brad. That makes a huge difference in how shooters shoot. Goes up for two. Perfectly executed. Let's get another look, Brad. Gave it up. He does the sweet fake shot. Looking for a screen on top and got it. Foul called off the pro hop. Nice move to the hoop. Points off turnovers, Dick. A stat I know coaches pay a lot of attention to. Hey, Brad, it sure is. You want to limit your opponent's number of points off turnovers. Ultimately, you want to nullify the easy baskets. Makes it. Syracuse have gotten themselves into a bit of a rhythm on offense, Dick. They're really on a nice run right here. Both free throws go. He can't shake the pressure. That was nice. Let's take a look at that last hoop. Defense giving some room. He shoots from the top of the key. It's good. Dick, they're doing a great job defensively down there in the low block. I tell you, what a great job on a defensive player. He's winning the battle on the interior because he's beating him to the spot. Looking for contact. He keeps the concentration off the contact for the score. in front to take it away. Transition opportunity coming up for two. The lane. He pump fakes. Time to pick up the defense here now. Terrific block shot though. He's a dominator blocking shots on the interior. Sinks it. Basic. And the fans here are loving the action. This place is rocking and rolling, baby. He shoots from the top of the circle. The Orange have a hot hand right now that's scoring for them at the moment. They need to keep feeding the ball. It's simple. Foul charge. Oh, and you can see the frustration as he picks up the foul. Oh, that's a bad, bad foul right there, Brad. Got a nice shot fake and has it rejected. Defense did a great job with that block shot. Now they work it around the perimeter. Tries for two. I love the sky hook, especially when you get great post position on the interior. like to get it inside to the low block unable to so far nice job of packing it in defensively yeah, they're really doing a great job packing it in Did a great job of anticipating that lateral pass 
That spin move's not going to work against this defense. That's a no-no. Here's a block from behind. My man was on a mission. Everybody's happy, including the school mascot. Well, the mascot's doing a little dance, baby, celebrating a lot of jubilation. He's got a high post flasher. With a bucket. Great play to take that to the basket. Has a nice look at the basket. Here's a double team. I love that block shot, Brad. Really gives you a lot of momentum. Those are the types of plays you want a lot of. These kids are on a roll. Look at them celebrating with one another. They're definitely having some fun out there. Trying to draw some contact. Basket falls despite the contact. At halftime, the Panthers are behind by 15. It's been an entertaining one so far, Dick. We can say that. What's your play of the half? There were some good highlights in that first half, but you got to look at this one. Watch how they got the ball inside for easy scores, which forced the defense to collapse, opening up the perimeter game. It's time to get back to the court, Dick, and see how their second half plays out. Syracuse shot a very good percentage in that first half. Patience and perfect execution paid a very big part in that, Brad. Great job by the offense. Dick started the second half. We take a look at our focus player, and he's going to have to be the man to come through. I think his teammates got to set him up somehow. They got to run some sets to get him free for some good shots. Looking for the foul, and he scores it off the glass. Pass in the paint. Double team now, bad angle. Goes up for two. For two, in and out. Smith has got the fans roaring in a quarter. The fans know exactly how much he has done for this program. And the ball goes out of play. Here they go, into the break. Dick, you think they're going to stay this hot? Hey, it doesn't look like they're slowing down, my friend. Picks off the pass. Line of ball, pressure, help side, it's all there. Isolated on the outside, they're working around the arc, looking for the open jumper. Dump it inside. From three-point territory. He gets the shot to fall. And as you would say right here, Mr. Vitale, flop city! I tell you one thing, <laughs> absolutely a flop. No doubt, Mr. Nestler. Oh, and he's not going to be happy with that call. Well, a silly foul right there, but look at his face. His facial expression tells it all. Good fake. He unloads off the rim and no good. Ball was loose, but the offense got it back. Look at that student body. They are going mad. The student body looks like they're having some fun out there. Working around the perimeter. Leaning in, trying to draw contact. Up and in. The Panthers are trailing by 18. They're working around the arc. 
I'll tell you, he missed the post guy. The post guy had the great angle, was locking on the box. You betcha. I'll tell you, great footwork, too, to create that opportunity. And then he's got the touch. What an offensive play. He didn't have the good angle. They should have got it to him about a second earlier. Tries for two. Perfectly executed. Looking for a good shot. On the dribble, gives it up. That spin move's not going to work against this defense. That's a no-no, baby. A defensive player beats him to the spot. Way off target. Tries the turn, and the defense comes up with a play. What a terrific play to stop that spin move. The ball goes out of play. You start comparing these backcourts, Dick, what are your impressions so far? You know, well, for me, Brad, good guard play will take you a long ways. If you think about teams in the past, they all had good guards who can apply good ball pressure, attack off the dribble, and distribute the ball. I can't emphasize enough how important backcourt play is. Trying to draw the foul. Drops the bucket despite the harm. Stolen. You really need to protect the ball around these guys. He shoots from left of the circle. Tickles a twine. On the inside. There's a double team right in there. He wants a three. Off the rim and no good. Looking to move it around the perimeter. Way out on top. Controlling the ball. Steal. Turnover. Great job knocking the ball loose, then chasing it down. The Carrier Dome is going crazy. The roof's about to come off this place. And a momentary look from three-point land. Gave it up. He went for the steal in the post, and he missed it, Dick. Oh, I'll tell you one thing. What a poor job defensively. He gambled. Let's go courtside. What do you got for us, Aaron? Brian Dick, I don't know if you can hear it from where you are, but I can hear it clearly. The coach is stressing to his team, go inside, go inside. They've been effective in this area all night long. What an asset to have. Aaron's right about that. I'll tell you one thing, she's essentially right. Down in the post is where you create a lot of offensive action. He shoots from the angle. Bounces off. He's got to get rid of it. High post screen, going to use it. Steals the ball. Work the perimeter. Spacing so important. Get 15 to 17 feet apart. He hits the shot. Looking for a good shot. And they come with a double team to stop it. Great defensive play. Anticipating well. When you're an anticipator, you got a chance to do well. A lot of guys, they're reactors. If you're a reactor, you're one step behind the action. Here's a double team. Offense gets it back after that ball was knocked loose. For the bucket. Syracuse have put together somewhat of a run here. Maintaining it is the key, though. They've got to continue to make the hustle plays at both ends of the court. With the fake. Now he faces up on the low block. I think it's great that he got a post player that can face up on the defensive player and attack the basket. Oh. 
fronts him first, Dick, and then works behind. Yeah, he's playing from behind him because that tells me right there they don't respect him as an offensive player. And they made an error, obviously, but they don't have the great respect. So they're saying, you know what? Let him get the ball and let him try to beat us. He comes away with it. Goes up for two. He gets it to go. Intercepted. Puts it up, looking for contact. They're lighting it up from the field right now, Dick. They're in a dangerous rhythm, my friend. Dangerous. Dangerous for the defense if they keep it up. Look at that spacing. This whole team that's on the floor is quick. But so is the defense, and they do a nice job. Points off turnovers, Dick. A stat I know coaches pay a lot of attention to. Hey, Brad, it sure is. You want to limit your opponent's number of points off turnovers. Ultimately, you want to nullify the easy baskets. Knocks it down. On the outside. Jumps into the defender. Gets it to go. The Panthers are down by 20. Robs him of the ball. You got to be careful when you go for those steals, Brad. Working it around the perimeter. Obvious foul. He got fouled and the bucket. He took it about himself, Brad. Big play, big time score. My goodness, Brad, what a play. That was a great play, Dick. I agree with you. He shouldn't let his emotions get the best of him, though. He better watch out. He goes to the line for the first time. Gets it. They work the perimeter. Leans in. He puts it in with contact and all. Picks off the lazy pass. For two, drains it. Double team now, bad angle. A whistle and a foul. The coach not happy in the sideline. Let's check in with Aaron Andrews and what she's got in store for us, Aaron. Brad and Dick, the coaching staff told me before the game, this is the one guy they need to get going quickly and early. They said when he gets hot, his entire team will follow suit and they'll feel good about having the game in hand. All right, thanks, Aaron. It out. Strips the ball. Look at speed. I'll tell you, man. There's nothing like having athleticism and quickness. On the dribble, gives it up from the top of the key. Great shot. I think that's why college basketball has the following it does, Dick. People from all over town and throughout the campus come and enjoy themselves at these games. It's crazy in here, Brad. Tries for two. I'm running right at the screen again. What did I say? Layup shot. I'm telling you, Brad, you could have a field day against these guys. Why don't you put a uniform on? Nobody within 10 feet of an easy basket again. I mean, unbelievable. It's blowout city. Takes the shot. Goes. He's working on that low block on that right hip. I'll tell you one thing, he's trying to deny him the ball initially, but the defense really doesn't do a great job of sealing him off. Gave it up. Picked off.
Trying to get that ball movement, get that good spacing. Got a wide open look. From right at the circle, he drains the shot. Tempo of the game, really important here. You want to establish some good tempo. Are they confused about who goes where on that double team? Oh, there's no doubt. Diggy's doing a nice job defensively fronting him. Well, it's the key is to really beat him to the spot, get help from the help side, and really do a great job seeing ball and man. The power forward receives the pass. Good defensive stance there against the spin move. Well, the key is to beat him to the spot. He did a great job. He anticipated that spin move. Here they come now on a turnover. Up and inside. This is college basketball at its best, Dick. Hey, pandemonium is in full effect. The Panthers trail by 25. On the outside, puts up the tray. He's money with the shot. I'll tell you one thing, that big guy down inside, though, is so big that really it's tough to deny him the ball. Defensively low block. Oh, nice job fronting him for the steal. Uh, terrific job creating the opportunity, and it really converts an offensive transition. Looking for a good shot. In the paint. The ball goes out of bounds. Post flasher is open for three, way off target. Isolated on the outside, they work it around the arc, looking for the open jumper. Top of the circle, they work it around the perimeter. Great play to take that to the basket. Shoots from the top of the key. The Panthers have got to continue to get him the ball. Brad, he's on fire. Picks off the pass. For the bucket. Perfectly executed. Dick, how's he working him defensively? I'll tell you, he's trying to front right now. You've got three concepts. You can play halfway, you can play behind or in front. They've decided to play in front, which means you got to get help some. Goes up for two. Great play to take that to the basket. They'll work it around the arc. On the inside. Jumps in. Perfectly executed. If you watch it again, it's even better. Work the perimeter. Spacing so important. Get 15 to 17 feet apart. He shoots from left of the circle. He is just lighting it up, Dick. He's beating his man to the spot and hit the shots, Brad. There appears to be a mismatch in the post. Let's see if they can get him the ball. Or two. I tell you, terrific shot. Really impossible to get a piece of that baby. The orange of a mismatch in the post. They need to get him the ball there. 
Pressure sure that basketball. Help one another. Communicate. Nice high post screen. Top of the circle. No good. Tries for two. Got it. Let's look at it again. They'd like to get it inside to the low block. Unable to so far. Nice job of packing it in defensively. Yeah, they're really doing a great job packing it in. Then a great job of anticipating that lateral pass. Moving it around the perimeter. On the dribble, gives it up. Up and inside. He tries the three ball. He shows the sweet touch. Bucket. Great play to take that to the basket. That spin move's not going to work against this defense. That's a no-no, baby. Defensive player beats him to the spot. On the outside, top of the circle, scorches the net. Runs him first, Dick, and then works behind. Yeah, he's playing from behind him because that tells me right there they don't respect him as an offensive player. And they made an error, obviously, but they don't have the great respect. So they're saying, you know what? Let him get the ball and let him try to beat us. move's not going to work against the defense I'll like that. Tell you, they did a great job scouting post play because they were really anticipating the spin. He launches a three. Ten on the shot clock. Working it around the perimeter. Down in the low block, trying to work the lane. And he scores despite the hack. There's the trap. Steals a pass. The offensive guy now is gaining position down there on the low block, Dick. I tell you, he gained big time position by getting the good angle, the good arm entry, and the real extension. He takes a three, gets it to fall. Gave it up. Great pressure, great double team. Really explosive. And now with a power move on the inside. Did a great job protecting the basketball. Seals the defense off and explodes to the basket. Long down court pass. Up and inside. They work the perimeter. He intercepts it. On the outside, on the dribble, gives it up. There they come. Got it. He gets the foul and the bucket. That's how you do it when you want to win, baby. Dick, look at this. He's not afraid to let anyone know how he feels. You've got that right, Brad. Number 33 makes his debut into the game. I tell you, this kid comes in with fire, Brad. He really knows how to bring it. it inside and he tries a drop step defensively nice job a uh, great job using his footwork defensively to beat him to the spot i tell you great job protecting the basketball getting deep post position and the jump hook is so effective they're working around the arc great defense gave it up 
Look the perimeter. Spacing so important. Get 15 to 17 feet apart. Our focus player update our final one of the ball game, and he led his team to victory. Well, I'll tell you, nine out of ten times, if the focus player plays well, you're going to get to the winner's circle. Great drive. How about the State Farm drive of the game? I tell you, he was explosive. He was up, up, and away. What a drive to the rack, baby. That was special. Syracuse simply blew this team away tonight. This is a surprise since the two teams were so evenly matched. It's been a fun game, and as always, my partners alongside have enjoyed you being with us. For Dick Vitale and Aaron Andrews, I'm Brad Nessler. Good night, everybody.